everybody, hope you're well. Just a very, very quick one. I've having a couple of beers, as you can probably tell. <laughs> Going through some cables in the box. If ever you see this, a shielding or a bit of plastic on the earth, be very, very wary of that. The whole point of um, this bit of plastic on a UK plug is that if a kid puts their fingers around the side of it, they've got a chance, or you've got a chance, you're going to get zapped, right? You don't need that on the earth. The whole point of the earth is a safety earth. So the more, the merrier. You shouldn't have less earth. You should have more. Okay. So if you see that, it's kind of saying these people don't know what they're doing by cloning it. And as it would turn out, it's absolutely true. I, I cut it off and I had a look at the cable. For a start, you can see it's sort of skinnier. And the second way you can tell is if this is the moody one. Look at that, it's springy, right? I can't twist it, I can't do anything with it. It's shit, it's not much of it, and it's springy. That's because it's not copper. It's copper clad, maybe, steel or aluminium. So it's shit. The reason that they use it is cheaper. This is what it should look like. It should be twistable, it should be bendable, it should be, you'll tell it very easily. Okay, that's copper, that's shit. Why does it matter? Well, copper can take a lot more current than this shit. And if you start putting this on a bar heater or something that's taking a lot of current, this whole cable can start melting and catch fire. So just a just a one to watch out for. Uh, if you see that, be very careful. If you see like a shielded earth or you know things like that, just maybe cut the plug off. You can always put another plug on it and check the cable. Of course, there are a lot of cables out there. Thanks very much for watching. Take care. See you all soon. Cheers. Bye.